TA. Very good against Gyro. Pretty good against the Lone Druid as well. Afterlife walking in. He's in a bit of trouble. Not leveled anything up just yet. Three-man Borrow Strike with a send back, though. Oh, but... Why didn't you go for the core here? Nice bit of chain still onto Seneco. Trouble is, Chen might just be losing his army here to this Kunker, cleaving through. Seneco. Rotated five people in. Boats nice coming snowball. through, catches the gyro, snowball up, but look at how many heroes they've brought in. Is this five? Ark's gonna pay the ultimate price as, yeah, five heroes from Gambit all come in. Even the blink from PA, all very good at dealing with the displacement abilities from Gambit. But look at this. Nico Baby in on top of Yoku with that Maledict going. He's still chasing the Witch Doctor. The last second of that Observer Ward, giving them the vision for it as well. <laughs> that's, that's really sad. He's going to be like, guys, they can see me. They've got vision here. Nope, that Observer Ward is now gone. Flow also gone. Top lane, homing missile connect. Mid tier one tower. Boat's gonna come through. Kunker, one more hit. Yeah, he gets it before the deny. Savage Roar into the glimpse. Ark is very tanky with the Coco's rum going, but it looks like they have the damage to take him out. Oh, Chen. Good micro. Stumps up the PA. Nico Baby. Yeah, he's gonna force out the shrine and the TP. Glimpse back with the homing missile flying, but the two man torrent connects with Seneco trapped inside the static storm. Gonna have to wander himself to the edge of that kinetic field, but here comes a snowball. Doesn't pick up Ark. They've got the X mark in onto Gyro, though. Where's the torrent? Throws it now. Drags him back. Yoku caught. In comes the Maldic with the cask, and Seneko's punch will do the trick. Big old cleave for the send back from Chen. Keeps Gyro alive. As Tusk will be the one to take a tumble, but Big Num trades back for it. Nico Baby blinks away. And Flo. Well, he's found a kill top lane. I was wondering where that was happening. Another X mark Another away from the glimpse. Split. And Ark torrent lands with the cask there. Not quite enough damage. Nico maybe doesn't want to jump in here. It's not really that safe. So he's going to TP himself back as far away as possible. But Sonic is going to be the casualty of war there. Ray didn't have the high ground here as well. Nico Baby just holding this little smoke pop choke point. Tusk jumped on with a static storm there. Oh, Snowball not quite in time. Now Yoku has to face off against the PA. Lone Druid pops into melee form, sprints away. They've got the send back on Yume. Ooh. Oh, is he going to pop in Fountain? Not sure about that. He will indeed as the Tusk Shards back on. He's brought back to continue oh, fighting. Punch up onto the Gyro, jump on the PA. Oh, the Gyro's in trouble. Doomed up. The episode of Burst Strike is good though. Ark, he's got an armor toggle, but he cleaves back and kills off Yoku. But he dies to the bear. Torrent not fast enough as Nico Baby charging forward. Death Ward down and Sonic clears up the Chen. Afterlife, he's in the sandstorm. Storm, but they've got reveal sentry on the very edge will scout them out and with only one hero remaining it's the lone druid back in fountain as a two for four exchange we need to go. already dead and this is where things get real dangerous if you don't escape fast enough you will die no vision on the dire heroes apart from chen up towards the northern side shards oh barely scraping oh it's a big oh. number but the dagger oh Oh, that's a butt clencher. Afterlife misses his stun mid, which Doctor's going to get caught by the Centaur, though, on the way through. A quick turnaround cask and Maledict, but he, that Disruptor is obliterated by Nico Baby. In the meantime, the boat flying forward. Afterlife has no way of escaping this now, as they lose two heroes on the retreat. We're all teeping into the shrine. A quick glimpse back, but there's the X mark arc. Moving forward, Doom onto Lone Druid in the back. This fight is taking place on like three different fronts. Sonic in the stack storm. There is no snowball save and the boat attempting there to save him up. Big Num looks like he'll be the casualty of Gambit. X mark. We'll catch on to you, mate. A quick kill on the Witch Doctor, but in jumps the PA. On strike back. Age is still up for... About 30 seconds, and it looks like Nico Baby with a quick BKB gets in on top of Yoku and takes the gyro down. 70 seconds with oh, he's got buyback. The trouble is losing a disruptor at the same time. A two for three exchange. Nico Baby and Ark, the two surviving. Afterlife in with the big borrow epi. Nico Baby, he's not got Aegis anymore. And a quick savage roar with entangling claws. Takes him out of the game again. Ark, oh, he's gonna survive this. He's not gonna be able to do though. He's got nothing left in the tank. Armor toggle on, maybe, but not enough. The time is over. And Gambit, I don't know how, but they they win that fight convincingly. They're holding a smoke themselves and the gem on the Sand King. If 
AFK20 go high ground here. This could be disastrous. Ward up. They see. They have vision. They jump forward. Now, Static Storm with the Burrow. Doom's been caught. He's absolutely slaughtered. BKB from the Lone Druid sprinting in. They've taken down the Disruptor. Two have gone. Now, the Lone Druid left high and dry to his own devices, and that will be the end of Dahak's Lone Druid. Dead for a minute and a half. He does have the buyback. Oh, here we go. Afterlife moving in. Two-man borrow. No, it's not. Nico Baby BKB is just in time. They turn and they get the crit down. Sam King's gone with a doom on Gyro. Okay, He's already got his BKB off, but Aegis snatched up by Nico Baby. It is killed off by the Dire team. Gyro's still doomed, but this sustain looking okay for the Dire squad. They've healed up Lone Druid, kept the Gyro alive, but Nico Baby is absolutely sweeping the other end of the fight. And with the nice buyback from Doom. Arriving yet again, they might just have killed off the Gyro. He's trying to heal up. He's got a Satanic going. They can't catch the LD, so they'll choose to go in onto Yume instead. Oh, there we have it. Nico Baby gets a triple kill. This is scary. Nico Baby. He, he's going in? <laughs> he's going in? What's, hap what's happening? They're going to glimpse him back. Uh, Borough Strike 4. I mean, he's got Aegis and BKB, I guess, but losing Aegis like that seems... So bizarre. Yeah, I think he had a couple of minutes left on it as well, so... Nice savage raw time. Guess this though. Snowball saves there. Nico Baby now BKB's up. The Doom onto Gyro. Sonic Death Ward out. He dies the Flat Cannon. And it looks like though Yoku has been obliterated. Oh, Afterlife, Epicenter, Borough Strike, onto two. Where's the Lone Druid? Damage output, not enough. The Kunker Cleave clears him up. The trouble is though, the Radiant team slow. dropping low. Nico Baby, oh, he's a slither away from death and the Borough Strike's gonna secure it. What is this game? I guess with a double damage rune on this PA. You feel reasonably good with the tools you have, oh. but there it is. Static Storm with Ags. Nico Baby actual. dead. Has buyback. Doom onto the Gyro. Quickly glimpses back Seneco. Has a snowball. If he buys a bit of time for himself, he can blink himself out of danger. He's got the Spirit Vessel on him, though, which makes things a little difficult. Shards maybe up onto the high ground if he can get this done, but he cannot, and that will be the end of him. And it's 50 minutes in. Get Your bored. brain gets a little bit bored. Go, yeah, yeah. Go, go feed a lot, you know. Why not? Right, it's a big stack still. On Conker. He has the double as oh. well. He is dead. Oh, he still has the right back, actually. Yeah, Nico Baby has BKB. Has Refresher Shard oh. been used? It has. The second stack stuff. storm. Nico Baby has been caught inside with a three man torrent. In comes Kunker. Where's the hit? It's not going to land. Flo stuck in between three. Oh. Finally gets it. Takes down the two in the back and crits through. But the lone druid standing tall with a savage roar where the boat will come on top of his head. And Nico Baby's buyback with that Kunker. They win a fight, but it is a costly one. Yeah, that's expensive. Buybacks on the PA, buybacks on the air. Uh... As top lane will go all the way up to the tier three top lane. And there, we quickly realize AFK 20. Get a quick D ward out, Sonic. Oh, this is spooky. Afterlife wants him. For a strike forward, you'll scepter up. A glimpse off. And they but will be able to glimpse well. Seneko into the Static Storm as well. Cask out onto Afterlife, but Seneko trapped inside that kinetic field for so long. Yoku does have to expend his BKB, but that's two heroes dead who will likely be forced to buy back. Like, when you get to this point, BKBs are low, it makes sense, right? Yeah. I mean, not going Pike must have been like the scariest thing in the world, but he's, he's oh, managed yeah, to make I, I it work. Have, I would have walked down and got the Pike for sure. Yeah. Oh, Gyro. DD with Ags. He's going to pop his Satanic and actually survive through this with BKB on, turns and fights. Lone Druid's battle cry up. Yoku, he's going to lose his first life here, it looks like. And the PA jumps in, finds that little old Chen, takes him down. Aegis, expended by Yoku as the Lincoln's popped, and in they come. Seneko ready, but Static Storm the second time. Yume's there, the Aeon Disc pops, and there's another one. Nico Baby's trapped inside, cannot do a damn thing. Stuck in the little field, and that is tragic for them as a two man Burrow Strike arrives from Afterlife. Ark going to work here with a big old hits and crits, and Gambit. Oh, they've killed Defended. the PA, yeah. but they've lost three themselves. Afterlife. Pokes his head out. Static Storm, Nico Baby. 
No save, the boat is all there is. Snowball, Snowball. to Nico, slides on through. Yoku in trouble, the blink forward. Nico Baby clears up the disruptor and looks a big numb now as the gyro trapped in the middle. Down. But the send no back, buyback. the send back. Oh, they're dead without buyback. They jump in with afterlife with the epicenter there, but the damage is done. Three heroes dead with no buyback. Lone Druid and Sand King, the last hero standing. But I think this might be the beginning of the end for Gambit as Seneko stands his ground and the Burrow Strike up will buy the time for afterlife to blink away. But this is good for AFK20. Nico Baby respawns with the buyback. Ball that PA. Gets back in the fight. Realizes this is the time to end it, hopefully. Lone Druid is farmed, but I'm not sure he can take on five heroes. Oh, I very much doubt it. Oh, dearie me. Gambit, this game has been so tight, but I think this is it. Sand King, Lone Druid, what can you do to stop this? It is do or die. There we go with the battle cry, but the ho, oh, the crit down to a third of his HP. Snowball in as well. So Nico buys the space, and the four staff will do nothing. Gambit tap out, and in another hour-long game, K20 take another win. Yeah, they played really well.